Yeah. Can we ask you about the breaking news, uh, Phoenix? Your, uh, tell, tell us about the MMA challenge you issued. Yeah. So basically, you know, like, like you figured out, when I see something I don't like, I fix it right away. Right. Uh, my brother fought in the UFC, and he lost. Not really, but according to the judges, he lost a, a split decision to Sam Stout, which I thought was garbage. You can't, you can't fault Sam Stout for it. You can't fault, uh, you really can't fault anybody but the judges. So I feel like the only way to get back at these guys, I'm going to get in the ring with Sam Stout, and I'm going to knock him out. Uh, and then I will feel much better. So it's, it's, a, it's one of the only selfish things I've used my superheroes for. There's nothing that anyone's going to get benefit from this, except for that I'm going to knock this dude out. And I'll probably donate some of the money to charity, too. <laughs> do you, um, is it set? Did you did you make the phone call and did you set it, or are you still waiting? I made the phone call. I left a message. Um, the girl who I talked to obviously didn't know who I was. She was a little confused. Um, she informed me that you can't just call the UFC headquarters and tell them who you're going to fight. <laughs> and I said, Batman called you and asked you if the Joker was staying there and told you he was going to come beat him up. What would you say? <laughs> and she kind of stopped for a second. She goes, well, I, I guess I would assume Batman was going to beat up the Joker. And I said, exactly. So can you call <laughs> <laughs> that is I don't know what the part of that jumped out at, but I basically said I want to beat up Sam Stout because not his fault. He just unfortunately made a superhero mad. It could happen to anyone, <laughs> you know. Uh, and then uh, I would like to beat up my brother as well, but I, I'd obviously have to have my mom agree on that. Now it happen. So 